Hello everyone and welcome back. It's your girl Marquita with Marquita LV Luxury. On today, we are going to speak on drop number two from the LV Times Kusama collection. Guys, you know about the collab. They did drop one, came back with drop two. And so I'm going to go over that today and honestly how I feel about it. But before we get started, make sure you view my past videos. Like, share, and subscribe. Tell a friend how much fun we have over here. Don't forget to visit your girl on Instagram at Marquita LV Luxury. Now that we have that out the way, you guys know exactly what to do. Go grab some wine or some tea and a light snack. Hurry back so we can get started. Only been a few hours, but it felt like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. Been gone for a year, only go like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. Guess I'm doing what I want Hope you know what you want What you want Okay, my loves, we are going to start with, of course, handbag of the day. Handbag of the day goes to the beautiful LV Damier Azur crew set handbag. I've been having this in my collection now for three years. I've worn her about three to four times, and so I told you guys, I am reaching for handbags that I usually don't reach for or I haven't used at all. So I was so happy to bring this beauty out. I just paired it kind of like with a sweater dress. It's really thin, but it was kind of cold this morning. And so guys, this was the look. Of course, I love carrying it as a tote and that's exactly what I did. So this beauty here was the handbag of the day. Okay, let's get into the real tea. I'm going to first start off by saying I am not here to offend anyone. I am not here to offend the creator of, you know, this collection at all. I didn't agree with drop one. I don't agree with drop two. I'm going to be honest. I left in my Instagram stories. It just kind of freaks me out just a little bit. So we are going to go over each handbag. And I am, like I said, I'm just going to give my honest opinion. Like I'm not here to stop you guys from purchasing from LV, the creator, at all, okay? So don't take it as ill. Hey, if Marquita don't like it, I don't like it. I don't want you guys to be like that. I just want you guys to hear how I feel, okay? So let's get started with the first handbag. Okay, guys, I had to take a seat because I am going to be going over a few handbags and I don't want to offend anyone. I don't want to offend the creator. I don't want to offend Louis Vuitton. I don't want to offend anyone if you feel like this collection is for you, okay? I'm only going to speak my opinion and if I offend anyone, I apologize in advance, but I can only be me and speak my mind, okay? The first thing I want to go over is the pumpkin handbags. And shout out to Foxy LV. She's on Instagram. These pictures are from her page. As you guys can see, the watermark will be on all the pictures. So the first things first, the pumpkin bags, like I said. The first pumpkin bag is in the is in monogram print, yellow being the main color with black with black monogram. I'm not a fan. I don't understand the pumpkins at all, but like I said, she's a creator and it was good enough for LV to give her a drop too. I heard LV collab with her before, so kudos to her, okay? The second pumpkin is the silver. I want to say this. I am a fan of the silver color. I am a fan of the silver hardware, the chain strap, and also the colorful monogram print. I think it will look bomb on a speedy 20, not on the pumpkin. I'm just being honest with you. So we have a yellow pumpkin that's coming out and we also have the silver uh, pumpkin that's coming out with the multi-color monogram print. Again, 
I'm not here to bash or say anything wrong. The inside interior looks very smooth, like probably microfiber material. The yellow has black interior and the silver has red interior. Again, the silver color is bomb, okay? The next thing I want to speak on, guys, is the, the dots are back. I thought we were done, but the dots are back. But this time, I'm happy because it's not the colorful dots, okay? You know, like the twister board, colorful dots. This blue, very, very cute. The first one is an on-the-go tote PM. I love the color. I most definitely wish they would give us this color in the on-the-go tote, okay? So this is the PM size. As you guys can see, um, she's infatuated with pumpkins. Like I said, I am going to go and do research and find out what this is about, okay? So this is the first one. The second is a beautiful Speedy 20 with the white dots then we have a nano noe we have the rosalie card holder we have a zippy wallet and we also have the clay card holder okay the clay card holder that is coming out so like i said the the blue is beautiful I just don't understand, like I said, the white dots. I just wish LV would give us what they are investing in this collab with Kusama. The next, beautiful dope. The colors, beautiful dope. This black and it looks like fuchsia, okay? So, the first one, they're very cute. It's an on-the-go tote MM. And when I say cute, I just mean by the color collaboration. I'm not a fan of the dots at all. The next is the Neverfull. I'm not a fan of the pochette Matisse at all. Like the bag tag, that pumpkin should not be on a pochette Matisse. They are honestly taking away from... Oh, the bags that we have in our collection. This is just too much. Too much. Okay. This is a Felici. I actually want to see how the insert looks from the Felici on this. Okay. And then we have a Victorine wallet. Okay. So the next is the white and red dot collab that she has going on. We have a twist PM. This is too many dots, okay? This is too many dots. This would look absolutely gorgeous. I love this white and silver hardware. Then we have a Clooney Mini. This should have been all white. We have a Neo Noe BB. All white silver hardware. We both definitely need a all white collection, okay? Even though I know, <laughs> I know me, but I would rather have all white collection silver hardware than have all white with red dots. Sorry. Then we have the Ammo BB. And to me, me being honest, I'm not a fan of the dots, but this Epi leather, this white Epi leather, the Ammo BB, this would be so nice and very, very different. And then we have a Zippy Wallet in Epi Leather. And then we have a Zippy Coin. And the Petite Sack Plaque. So all of these handbags are in Epi Leather. And I'm not a fan of this handbag, even when LV released it. I think it's the, the Marilini, the Marilini. So again, all empty leather. Okay, so I'm going to get into some handbags that kind of just really, really just topped it off, kind of pissed me off because we need these handbags. And I feel like LV, they're playing games with us now, okay? So look at this beautiful, oh my gosh, look at this beautiful on the go tote mm in black on front leather look at the monogram we have the giant monogram okay i love this 
minus the flowers. On our on the go tote MM, you know what? I looked up, let me grab my bag. So, this is what we have. You guys know we have the giant print on the go tote MM. We need the smaller monogram, not the nanogram, not the giant LV print. Can we meet in the middle? <laughs> Can we have this? The regular size monogram on the on the go tote MM, like you're giving her. I don't understand. So this will be so dope, like I said, minus the flowers and the butterfly. You guys see this, the speedy bandolier size 25 minus the flowers and the butterfly. Gold hardware, this is the perfect speedy bandolier 25 on front leather, very carefree. And then you have the capucine size BB. Guys, look how beautiful this color is. Look at this beautiful cream. The Neverfull. Ooh, look at this on the go tote. On the go tote PM in this color is very, very gorgeous. And then you have another Capucine. So this collection, this line here, okay? Very bomb, very beautiful, minus the flowers and the butterfly. LV, collab with us. Collab with, with your clients. Collab with us. We want to collab with you. <laughs> listen to our videos. You guys do listen because you created the mini pochette on chain. Listen to us. We want the same thing you are collabing with Kusama. Collab with us. We will pay. We will buy. Collab with us. Oh my gosh. Okay, next, this is, this is what just made me get off of Instagram today. This was it. This is what freaked me out and I just had to run, okay? Not trying to offend, but the face on this scared me. I'm sorry. Um, of course, monogram. We have this already, but like I said, I'm going to hear it get through this. This this scared me, okay? And then you have the toiletry on chain. I have to do my research. Because I also see on here, like you can honestly tell this is probably something that she went through. That's why I say I want to be careful with my words. Because I do see on here, it's like a sun. But the sun has teardrops. So she's expressing herself through her art. Okay. But again, I need to understand before I stand behind anything. And if it freaks me out just once I see it, I need to understand what she was kind of going through and what it stands for. Because I don't back up everything. I told you guys, I am real big on that. I don't back up everything and I don't allow everything in my house. The next is a Speedy Bandolier 25. Yeah, I have to hear it and go through this collection. <laughs> the, the Emma BB. And this doesn't have a face. I don't know what it has on the opposite side, but this here has a fish with the dots. And then here we go again, guys. Uh, this is the on-the-go tote MM. I told you guys we need monogram, but I prefer black leather, not Vachetta. So, we have the on-the-go tote MM, the Neverfull MM, the Speedy Bandolier 25, the Ammo BB, and the Toiletry on Chain. All monogram print with Vachetta, but with her creation. It looks like these are patches sewn, um, that they have sewn on. I don't know, and I'm not trying to find out. So, let's get past that, okay? Now we have the pumpkins. So, the two travel kits that I saw. She has the first one, the pumpkins. I'm not sure what that stands for. The Horizon 55. You know, the Horizon travel, um, the travel case comes Horizon 55 soft, and then you have the hard. 
I have the sauce and I showed that on Instagram. And then you have the Keep All Bandolier. I have the size 50 and this is a size 45. As you guys can see on here, the pumpkins, now you can see that it's three of them very clear. You have the one in the middle, the orange, and then you have the red here and then you have the yellow on the other side. Okay, again, we have the on the go tote MM with the monogram with the pumpkins again. We have the on the go tote PM in monogram with the pumpkins. The never full MM. We also have the neo noe. We have the beautiful Speedy 20 bandolier, which is one of my favorite bags in my collection. And we have a cosmetic bag that's coming out. And also, we do have Petite Set Plaque that I have here. I usually take this on, on vacation, just a small tote. Here, and so, like I said, I'm not sure what's up with the pumpkins. If any of you guys have a, you know, know the backstory, myself, I am going to try to YouTube and find out what the face is for and what the pumpkins stand for, the crying tears on the sun, the flowers, okay, to me, seem like a rebirth, um, new growth. It could, I don't know. I really, really don't know, but I want to understand before I speak negative about anything. I'm only telling you guys what, what I'm not interested in because it just doesn't give me a good feeling, okay? Okay, the, the bandos. The bandos are cute. I can say that even the dots, the blue dots, the bandos are cute. I'm not a fan of the pumpkin, but I love the monogram and blue. <sighs> Guys, it's just really, really hard for me to go over this collection. It's just an inside feeling. It's just an inside feeling. Like I said, it's just hard for me to go over the collection. So, guys, she even have ready to wear that's coming out. She has shoes that are coming out. All I can say is LV, they went all the way in with this collab. I haven't seen them do a collab to where they invest this much. Honestly, they invested a lot of time, a lot of just creating and putting this out there. A drop one and a drop two. It's just something in here, okay? It's just something in here. So let me know how you feel like I said, it was kind of hard for me to even get through this video. It was just an inside feeling. Again, I am not trying to stop you guys from purchasing. Only giving you how I feel. This drop is much better than drop one. I can give her that. But again, I won't be purchasing anything from this club at all. Um, I don't know what Lane or what LV is doing. That's all I can say. But... Let's talk. Let's chit chat. We miss Handbag Bestie Friday. I can't wait to catch up with my besties. Let me know how you feel, guys. As always, stay safe, stay blessed. Until next video. Bye-bye.